Ascariasis is the most common worm infection. It affects around 16% of world population. Ascariasis is caused by worms, which is called ascarid. It's parasite into our body. And if you ever seen worms come out or exit from nose or mouth, it's ascarid. It's ascariasis. Such cases are rare. Usually, this worm live into intestine, but sometimes they travel towards mouth and they can come out of mouth. Now let's say how infestation occurs and how this infection starts. Usually, children playing into soil which is contaminated, they ingest eggs. After these eggs travel to small intestine, they hatch into larva. It is called larva stage. This is larva. This larva penetrates into small intestine and travel to lungs via blood. Into lungs, they have maturation stage and they stay into lungs around 10 days, 10 or 14 days. And after this, person usually swallows this larva again into stomach and then uh, small intestine. And person swallows this larva because from lungs, this larva ascends into uh, eye rays and they uh, the and person swallows it again that's the mechanism so we have two stages shorter period of stage short uh, and shorter pace is lung pace and intestinal pace intestinal pace in is longer pace during uh, lung pace larva can irritate our lungs and cause coughing, difficulty breathing, and sometimes eosinophilic pneumonitis. It is called uh, Loeffler syndrome, uh, and eosinophilia in the blood. Eosinophil levels are increased because when larva penetrates into bloodstream, our immune system reacts against this larva, and eosinophil level is elevated. After lung pace, intestinal pace occurs. Uh, intestinal, during intestinal pace, in the intestine already there is matured worms and they can cause discomfort um, and it, it can be work uh, symptom because person may feel generalized discomfort and actually it can be abdominal discomfort, abdominal pain, which may worsen after meal nausea, vomiting, loss of appetite, loss of uh, weight loss. Sometimes in kids during sleeping there is teeth grind, uh, grinding because um, discomfort into uh, our stomach can be uh, converted as a teeth grinding into kids. These symptoms usually last around 8 to 16 weeks. A hallmark of this disease is passing of worms into stool. And in rare cases, these um, worms can out from mouth or nose, as we already uh, said about it. This happens when there is heavy infestation or when a person intakes uh, medication and uh, this uh, environment already not good for worms and they travel uh, uh, gastrointestinal tract, they travel esophagus and out of mouth. How we diagnose? We diagnose uh, with um, examination of stool for worms or eggs. Uh, this confirms diagnosis, examination of stool. Abdominal x-rays and ultrasound sometimes is useful. And sometimes, as a complication, we can see block of bile duct or pancreatic duct. Here we can see um, block of bile duct into um, abdomen, and you can see this worm here. 
which is milky or creamy and what is treatment uh, first line treatment is albendazole anti drugs and mebendazole uh, albendazole has effectivity 88% and mebendazole 95% slightly mebendazole is superior uh, but even one intake of this drug is enough to eliminate um, these worms reinfection can happen anytime if person eats these eggs again usually in 85% of cases person even is infected these worms he or she is asymptomatic so no symptoms or very minimal symptoms and after one to two years our body will naturally clear out this worms because these worms will finish their uh, life cycle but if person ingest eggs again then reinfection occurs uh, so oh, where we should be more careful tropical and subtropical area of the world its main area where um, uh, ascariasis is common this area actually and if you travel there of you of uh, or if you're drinking untreated water or unsafe food then ascariasis is possible and is suspected um, but it can occur at any country almost everywhere it's possible it affects around 16 percent of world population and it's huge huge spreading so we should be careful anytime but it's more common in tropical and subtropical countries thank you for your interest thank you for your watching if you like my video please thumbs up if you like my channel please subscribe thank you very much bye for now